Yo, 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 what's good, YouTube, man? It's the big Aussie piece of ink. Y'all should already know what we are here for. Y'all see the title. Y'all see the thumbnail, man. In today's video, I'll be giving you the most unblockable and overpowered dunk packages for my guards and for my bigs. My small guards, tall guards, whatever type of guard you are, I got you. You guys will never get blocked with. You guys are trying to rim run and drive to the pink. And for my bigs, it's literally our job to dunk. So, hey, we definitely can't be getting blocked when I try to go out for a dunk or missing dunks like the guy behind me just missed a dunk. I'm telling y'all, with these dunk packages, you guys will never miss dunks. You guys will never get blocked. You guys will only just get straight dunks, straight posters, straight contacts. Before I even give you guys the keys to dunking MB 2K23, because after the video, you guys will be dunking demons, man. I need y'all to do three things for me. Number one, stop opening what you're doing. Stop breathing. Stop eating. Stop typing. Stop talking. Go down and drop a like on this video right now. Let's go for 80 likes on this video. I'm not I'm not playing with you. You right now that haven't watched that haven't liked the video yet, but it's still listening to me talk. I'll pause it right now and go like it bro i'm not playing with you bro you got three seconds before i come over and do some things to you pause hey yo the second thing I'm going to ask y'all to do is to drop a sub. Now, this one I can't technically force y'all to, but hey, if y'all fuck with the content, man, you might as well just subscribe and help the channel grow. We're trying to hit 25,000 subscribers as soon as possible. And the last thing I'm going to ask y'all to do is to turn on the notification bell so y'all don't miss a single upload. You know what I'm saying? I drop a lot of videos on this channel from man to 2K, from shooting tips to dunking tips like this video to helpful tips to funny gameplays. I do it on this channel, so I'm telling y'all, y'all do not want to miss an upload a quality, quality be uploaded so make sure y'all do them three things hit the like button hit the sub button and subscribe with notifications turned on and with that being said let's get into the animation story man let's go first up we're gonna start off with the confidence and i know y'all see the top right corner i'm actually on my roommate's account bro this is not my account but hey that doesn't really matter because we're just here for the dunk for every single dunk you need to have a minimum of an 84 driving dunk regardless of what build if you guys are a center a small forward a power forward a guard a shooting guard it doesn't matter you guys need to have a minimum of an 84 driving dunk to get any contact dunk and if you're gonna get the elite ones you're gonna have to have a 92 contact dunk a 92 driving dunk now i'm not saying you guys have to necessarily have it but if you guys can go up to 92 please go up because i'm telling you the elite contact dunks on top of the pro contact dunk just go crazy now let me read out all the requirements for every single one so for the pro contact dunks of two and the pro contact dunks of one you guys only need an 84 driving dunk i technically don't have it on this build it's not even my build but it's only have the 76 driving dunk but if you guys have an 84 driving dunk you guys can get the pro contact dunks off two and the pro contact dunks off one now for the elite contact dunks of two and elite contact dunks off one you guys need to have a 92 so if you guys have a 91 a 90 i'm sorry y'all can't get it you need to have a 92 or above to get every single elite contact dunk next is the small contact dunks of two and the small contact dunks of one i'm i'm in the name i literally said that it's for my small build my guard build because you guys need to have at least an 86 driving dunk and at least i'd be under the height of six foot five so for my guards if if you guys are under six foot five and have at least an 86 plus y'all are chilling y'all can get small contact y'all can get pro contact for sure and if you guys make it onto the 92 plus y'all can get every single one so guard the minimum y'all can get is an 84 drive but an 84 driving dunk is just the pro if you up it to 86 you guys get the pro as well as the small contact and if you guys up it to 92 you guys will get the pros the elite and the small contact dunks now the pro big man and elite big man contact dunks are for the bigs as it literally says in the name so for the pro you guys need an 80 standing dunk not driving dunk it's up to the standing dunk you guys need to have an 80 standing dunk plus at least be six foot ten so this is for my big boy builds and then for the elite big man contact dunks you guys need to have a 90 standing dunk gonna be at least six foot ten but if you get to make it a six foot ten plus build make sure the standing dunk is at least an 80 if y'all can get it to a 90 feel free to do that as well but make sure it's at least an 80 to get get at least the pro big man contact dunks all right man we're gonna be starting with the dunks for the guards now I know we in the layup side right now because I always like to start off every single dunk package by showing guys the layup you guys should have. And for my guards, y'all want to equip. Where is he? Let me find him. The man himself who's in some controversy right now. I can't lie. Where is he at, bro? Ja. Moran, I'm telling you, his layups are unblockable because you guys literally don't know what he's gonna do. Now, for the Jam Moran, the requirements are at least an 82 driving layup and be under 6 foot 10, which is why I'm saying it's mainly for my guards. So, if you guys have an 82 driving layup and under 6 foot 10, which my guards are definitely gonna be under 6 foot 10, make sure you guys put on Jam Moran because it is the best layup package for all y'all guards. Now, we're actually gonna start with the dunk, starting off with Clyde Drexler, one of the greatest dunk packages in every single 2K. From even from NBA 2K20, I said 
started using it and I haven't gone back. 2K20, I used it. 2K21, I used it. 2K22, I used it. And 2K23, I'm still using it. I bet in 2K24, I'm gonna still be using it as well, bro, because he just glides, bro. He got to glide through the air and it's literally unblockable. I've never seen one of these get blocked ever. All right, so make sure you guys have on Clyde Drexler. Now, the requirements for this are at least an 80 driving duck and you guys have to be under six foot ten. All right, next is quick drop off one and quick drop off two. The most basic, but by far the most efficient, by far the most easiest one, and the most one of the most important ones the quick drop off one and the quick drop off two. Now, the requirements for this is just an 80 driving dunk on the quick drop off one and a 65 driving dunk on the quick drop off two. So, I'm telling y'all, if y'all can get up to 80, then get the quick drop off two. But if you guys can get up to an 80 driving duck, I'm telling you, quick drop off one is low key better than quick drop off two. Plus, quick drop off one is literally unblockable because he goes up and before the defender even has time to contest you, you guys already dunked the ball. So, I'm telling y'all, make sure y'all put on quick drop off one and quick drop off two. Next, we have the front clutches and the requirements for this dunk package is it's a 78 plus driving duck. I'm telling y'all, once you guys put this on, you guys will never get blocked with it because he literally puts the ball in front of him and the defender won't even have a single chance to block him because they guys are gonna bulldoze right past him when he gets in the animation so i'm telling y'all front clutches is heavily slapped on but you guys shouldn't sleep on it and y'all should equip it right now next we have windmill baseline reverses now you guys need to have reverse baseline dunks in every single build whether you're a guard or a um a big now why do you guys need baselines bro because if you guys go baseline and get to do a reverse it will give you guys a layup which is very easy to get blocked when you guys do reverse layup but reverse dunks are practically impossible because he literally jumps under the rim and then dunks it the defender has zero chance of blocking you once you guys get this animation off so i'm telling y'all one of the best if not the best reverse package for the baseline had to be windmill baseline reverses which is an 80 plus driving dunk to actually equip and the other baseline reverse you actually get is a clutch baseline because once again just like the windmill is literally impossible to block because he literally goes right under the basket and then he dunks it the defender has a zero percent chance of blocking this if you guys actually get the animation off so make sure you guys have on clutch baseline reverses and windmill baseline reverses have a clutch baseline reverses that also needs an 80 plus driving dunk so these two if you have an 80 plus driving dunk make sure you equip the windmill baseline reverses and the clutch baseline reverses next up we have the tomahawk and the two most basic ones you guys need are the sidearm tomahawk and the straight arm tomahawk now for the sidearm tomahawk it requires a driving dunk of an 80 plus and i'm telling you this shit never gets blocked you know like the lebron dunk he does that never gets blocked that's literally this package bro so make sure you put this on i'm pair it with this great arm tomahawk put this on as well and i'm telling y'all y'all will go crazy bro i'm telling y'all the straight arm tomahawks if you were here in 2k22 everyone and their mother were just tomahawking over and over and over again and on the defense it was mad annoying because you literally couldn't block it bro so make sure y'all have on straight arm and sidearm tomahawks now the last tomahawk package you're gonna get is the athletic front tomahawk and the only reason we are getting it is because it's in front you guys should never get the athletic side tomahawk because anything athletic can easily get blocked if it's not in the front look he cocks it back to his side you guys should never ever put on the athletic side one but with the athletic front he literally puts it in front so they have zero chance of doing it and he just dunks it really quick and really aggressively and really really hard so i'm telling y'all athletic front tomahawks will never get you blocked it's a quick fast and efficient dunk practice to have on i guess only an 80 plus driving dunk will put it on so make sure y'all have on athletic front tomahawks as well next up we have the layup and dunks to my bigs so i'm telling off with the layup we're gonna go for the, the you know we gotta go for the most basic but the most efficient one long athlete by far the best animation for my big and it requires a driving layup of an 88 plus so yes i do know it is quite taxing on a driving layup but if y'all can put on long athlete i'm telling y'all it's the best one bro i'm telling y'all y'all never get blocked with this shit now on to my dunk style because we all know that the dunks are the most important thing that's what we're here for in the video and that's my bigs we're gonna start off with clyde drexler once again clyde the glide i don't gotta explain it because i explained it just before my uh, my guard one the clyde drexler is literally just gliding to the air you can't get blocked and yeah make sure y'all put it on the requirements for this dunk package is at least an 80 plus driving dunk and under the, the height of six foot ten so my six foot ten bigs i'm sorry y'all actually can't get this but for my six foot nines six foot eight even six foot sevens if you can equip clyde drexler make sure y'all equip that bro and next up is dwight howard one of the most dominant bigs in his prime now he's playing overseas but in his payday this man dwight howard was a demon bro and why is his dunk package so good because he has really great standing dunks and for my bigs we all know standing dunks are very important so if you want unblockable standing dunks make sure you put on dwight howard the requirements for this dunk include this your standing dunk has to be a 75 or above the 
if driving that has to be a 65 plus it just have to be at least six foot ten so this is for my very big builds all right for my six foot ten plus bro go crazy with the dwight howard bro i'm telling y'all y'all will never get blocked with this tiny dunk ever again next up is sean kemp one of the best packages to never get blocked because his animations are just so smooth and he just gets to the basket without doing too much he's not doing some crazy ass flashes he's just putting the ball up and putting it in the basket that's really all we need we don't need anything too flashy we just need to secure the bucket so the requirements for this dunk package include a static dunk of 70 plus a driving dunk of 82 plus and he has to have to be at least six foot ten so once again this is for my six foot ten plus builds so if you can get if y'all can equip Sean Kemp, please do it. Next up is Daryl Dawkins. This is by far the most slept on one because not a lot of people in these days actually knows who Daryl Dawkins is. And I'm telling y'all, his dunk packet in this game is just so phenomenal. I've never gotten blocked when it got uh, bro. Look at that standing dunk animation. Y'all are putting it for this one right here. The one-handed standing dunk. He puts it up and puts it down before the defender even has a chance of contesting it. Bro, I'm telling y'all, that standing dunk right here is probably the sole reason why this is one of the best and one of the most slept on dunk packages for bigs a standing dunk of at least 75 a driving dunk of at least 75 and be over six for ten so once again for my six for ten build y'all can get standing up like this and just go crazy so if y'all can get it please get it next up we have the diesel shaquille o'neal i don't even need any explanations but this guy was so dominant i ain't even gonna waste that much time on describing it because you already know how great this man was but the requirements for this build but the requirements for the dunk package are a standing dunk of at least 80 a driving dunk of at least 50 55 and be over six foot ten in height so for my six foot ten plus build i'm blessing y'all with these tiny dunk packages y'all will never ever get blocked again i'm telling you next we're gonna go into more modern times with the quote-unquote modern version of shaq which was shaq himself said and we have Giannis and Tedo kumpo bro i'm telling you one of the best players in the league right now multiple time mvp he has a ring we all know how great Giannis is that his dunk packet is even better because it's quick it's smooth and it's efficient because we all know Giannis is a very strong but a very quick big man having a strong and quick dunk package is essentially exactly what we need as a big so the requirements for this include a standing dunk of 75 plus a driving dunk of 75 plus and it gets have to be at least six foot five so hey i'm telling you any single build can any single big book can get this because if you guys are six foot eight six foot nine six foot ten six foot eleven even seven feet you guys can still get this dunk package so make sure y'all don't leave Giannis out of your dunk packages next up we may have surprising ones but we have ben simmons now why is ben simmons on this list ben simmons is a literal six foot ten point guard you know what that means he has the size of a big but he moves like a girl which gives him quick easy and efficient dunk packages so i'm telling y'all ben simmons dunk package as a big is very very meta the requirements for this include a 65 plus standing dunk a 75 plus driving dunk i guess have to be at least six foot five so once again this goes for any single big build y'all can put this on i'm telling y'all y'all just have some quick and efficient dunk packages with this one right here and the last nba player not the last dunk package but the last nba player we're gonna equip is carl anthony towns the cat himself now what's so good about this one is that his shit is just so quick and efficient that's all we're here for we're not here for the 360 behind the back as the up off the back but we don't need any of that we just need quick efficient simple and effective dunks and carl anthony towns dunk package is exactly that so the requirements are a 75 plus standing dunk a 55 plus driving dunk and at least six foot ten so this is once again for my six foot ten plus bigs next up we have the tomahawks you know the straight arm tomahawks we all know how good this is uh, you guys need at least an 80 plus driving dunk to get a straight arm tomahawk same thing for the sidearm tomahawk you can need an 80 plus driving dunk and i'm pairing this up pairing up sidearm tomahawk as well with the straight arm tomahawk but i'm telling y'all y'all will be going crazy in that pain and for my bigs and for my bigs only this is not for the guards i would recommend uber athletic tomahawks off one not off two because that'll take way too long and it's way too easy to get blocked but off one bro he's quick he's efficient he's athletic and he gets it in very very quick so hey mix y'all put on uber Uber Athletic Tomahawks off one if you guys have a 90 plus driving dunk. Yes, it is pretty taxing. You guys have to have a pretty high driving dunk. But hey, if y'all can put this on, please put it on, bro. Next are the baseline reverses. I'll be all of the two best ones are the windmill baseline reverses, which require a driving dunk of 80 plus. All right, so make sure y'all can put this on if you guys have an 80 plus driving dunk. Put it on windmill baseline. I'm paired out with clutch baseline reverses, which also requires an 80 plus driving dunk. And these two paired together, you guys will never get blocked on a baseline. 
baseline. I mean, all know big using baseline dunks is very broken, bro. It's very hard to guard. So, hey, make sure y'all use this, utilize this move, utilize the baseline, and get some quick, efficient, and unblockable dunks. All right, next up, we have the pro under basket rim pulls, which requires a standing dunk of at least 65 plus. Now, why this is such a good package that he literally just goes up and goes down? Nothing fancy. It's just a rim pull, basic standing dunk that's gonna get the bucket and it's never gonna get blocked. I'm pairing that up with the elite basket rim pulls, which is just the elite version of it, just the better version of it. It just go, it just makes sense. Now, for this one, you guys only need a standing dunk of 70 plus. So, if you guys can get a 70 plus standing dunk, y'all can get the elite basket rim pulls as well as the pro basket rim pulls. And the last package I'm gonna recommend for my bigs is the quick drop up one. We already know what this is, bro. We, I mean, I don't think this shit needs any explaining. I can't lie, bro. This shit is just probably one of the best dunk packages, period, bro. And it only requires an 80 plus driving dunk, man. So if y'all can get quick drop up one for my bigs, please do.